This is Mike Callahan, Dr. Filefinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on how you can remember things on your iPhone using Recall. Recall is free. It's available in the Apple App Store. You can just go there, search for it, download it to your phone. You can have a free account on their website. Now you tap it, it starts to load. You see here where it says Recall is typing what you said. You use your voice to put things in, or you can type things in. Now, if you're curious what that is processing, you can simply tap on that. You see, I can play the audio recording and hear what it is that I said. It shows that it's pending, that it's in to-dos, that there's no due date. You can see at the top what date it was added as a recall item. On the website, you can go in and edit things that you have. If you tap up at the top under time, you see things that are due today, things that are due soon, later, or overdue. You can have things assigned by places. You can assign things to other people. You can have a memory jogger. Now, if you tap the plus sign, you can add a recall, and you can add by voice. If you want to do that, you tap anywhere to start. You have 30 seconds. Say your recall. Tap when you're ready to stop. Or you can add by text. You have this text box, the keyboard. You can type in your reminder. And then when you're done, you can hide the keyboard. And you can also set things like for. Or you can let recall decide where it's at. You can assign a place. And in, you can let recall decide. So this is recall. We'll be doing some more tutorials on recall because it's a fairly useful and comprehensive program for remembering things. And that's all there is to it.